In this video we're going to show you the option to place concrete diaphragms on steel I-cutters. So this could be placed at the beginning and the end of the bridge, uh, considering options like the left and right extensions of the concrete, uh, offset from the beam, and as well the option to create an opening for the bearing seats on the bottom of the beam itself. So these options could be set up uh, differently from the beginning or the end of the abutment and it's just a matter of specifying that as we place it right so as you can see i need to adjust some of the dimensions here to leave room for that opening itself and then showing you as well the extra extension that i'm applying to the right side of the deck and the left side as well so it could be placed immediately after we use the command or just editing these options after placement so we can just uh, these dimensions uh, uh, could be of course in uh, feet or meters uh, as you can see uh, and that's on the left side a little short but also we can extend these to to the right side as well so it's just a, a matter of selecting what option to use we can control as well the width and the height uh, of that concrete diaphragm it, it doesn't need any extra definition or library to set that up so as i said it's just a matter of uh, using the the proper dimensions for the tool And then there's also there is a new property in the Explorer that you can set up and well as another feature of the feature.